In this tag, I'm going to show you how to use the embed tag in HTML. As you can see here, I have a YouTube short that I've embedded and a full length YouTube video along with an image. So I'm going to just start with my simple embed tag. I'm going to describe the type of video or type that I'm going to use. And the type that I'm going to use to do my YouTube short or my YouTube video is a video backslash uh, webm file. The next thing I'm going to do is go to my source equals. And I'm just going to come over here on a YouTube short. I can click uh, share here, uh, click on my embed. It works the same way for a video. And I'm going to copy here the source uh, portion of the tag. Now I could do that iframe tag, but in the code.org studio, you're not allowed to use it. So this is a workaround to embed uh, videos as well. So I'm gonna use that source right there. I can set the uh, width and the height of my player. I just like to set one because this allows me uh, to keep the ratio. And if I do, let's say 400 uh, pixel, and then I can close that out. We can see that video here uh, on this one. I'm going to do my height as well, and 600 pixels. My quotation mark, and there we go. We can see that YouTube short that came up there right now. Uh, same exact way for a YouTube video to do an image, or if I wanted this to be separated on lines, I'm going to use the line break code, which allows me to line break or enter to give that a new line. The image is going to be the same exact thing. You can see here I have that embed tag. The type instead of a video is going to be an image backslash JPEG. The way I find that here is I just can pull up my image on YouTube. I can right click on this and I want to copy my image address. What I'll do then is come over to my code.org studio. I'm going to use that same embed tag. I'm going to do my type on that. And again, it's going to be image backslash JPEG. I'm going to give that next source. I'm going to paste in that link. I'm going to close my tag out and you're going to see that my height and width are extremely large. So I'm going to come back in and edit it. And I'm going to do my height at 200 pixels. And again, if I like the ratio on that, I can keep it. Uh, and then I can do a line break to get everything on its own line. So we can see here in my web page now, uh, with the line break, everything's on its own.